that film, I suppose, uh, has a lot of resonances for many of us who've been in politics and not managed to um, get to your heights. But I think uh, that interview at the end, where you are clearly disappointed, is the experience of a lot of women in politics. Yeah. Yeah. I've found over the years that women try to fit in with the way that men organize, and men organize in peer groups, yeah. and women think that merit is enough, mm. and it almost never is. And yet women have to deal with disappointment whatever height mm. they get to. Mm. Uh, Helen, what do you think we can do about it? <laughs> well, I, I guess we have to have the coalitions which put more women in winning positions, don't we? Um, I mean, I think my feeling at the end of it was more that, you know, it had been a, in many ways a waste of six months of my time. I do have other things to do with my life. And by the way, I've discovered them. Life's quite good, uh, you know, uh, ne never having to go to another boring meeting at the United Nations in my life. I'm so e ecstatically happy about this. <laughs> Uh, I mean, having said that, I, I loved UNDP and I loved the things I did there, but there, 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 were, there were downsides, uh, believe me. Uh, but now that I'm free, I'm a dangerous woman because I can say some things. So, yeah, no, I, I think, um, you know, women need to be extra resilient going up for, for these jobs and uh, you have to d develop a pretty, pretty tough shell around yourself and keep your family close and your friends close because the that's what you'll fall back on in the hard times. And the reality is that over you know, political careers, you, you experience a lot of that. I think a political career was great preparation for that campaign because uh, you get your head kicked in fairly often in a political career. Uh, I had 15 years in a party in government when I was an MP and 12 years in opposition, which on averages ain't bad. But there were certainly you know, the low points as well as the high points and you kind of learn to cope with that. And uh, some of your family are here, here, here this afternoon. Oh yes, proud family here today. Nieces, sister-in-law, <laughs> nieces-in-law. You know. I kind of worry though that your popularity might be overtaken by your dad, George. <laughs> <laughs> it's, he's being nominated for Best Supporting Actor. 